about what happened with Connor or allegedly happened in Ireland with hitting a mob guy? No, but I don't think it's true because no. if it was true, it would be big. Connor can friggin', you know, Connor can walk down the street and it's big news now. Mm -hmm. You know, if, if Connor, if this was true, I, I just have to believe it would be off the charts crazy. Did, did you call him or call Audie or anybody at all to no. find out about that? No. If and it's I, true, we'll end up finding out. I don't chase. I can't chase all these things around. If they're true, the, we'll get it figured out and we'll go from there. Does it concern you, though? You know, you had a history with uh, wise guys back in Boston. Yeah. The fact that allegedly one of the guys he had was in the mob. If that's true, that's probably not a very good thing for Connor, right? And uh, yeah, uh, can't be. It can't be a good thing for Connor. Well, can you? Can you? But you never know. I don't know how that stuff works among. You know, I didn't. I didn't know any of those guys or, or, or any of that stuff, but it can, I'm sure it can be worked out too. You know, uh, didn't uh, you know Jake Lamotta's brother beat the shit out of a wise guy too when they figured it out? I was gonna say I mean, the, the one we, we don't know about that one yet. The one we do know about, we haven't heard you guys talk about or off a comment <clears> on was the issue in Bellator where he jumped the cage, pushed the referee, slapped the employee, the Bellator employee that was trying to get him off the cage. I mean, can you give us an update? I'm just kind of where his head is, where you guys stand, I mean, is he going to face any punishment for that? Because, I mean, yeah. it seemed like pretty inexcusable behavior. Listen, the the punishment, you know, he was being dealt with by, by the head of the ABC. And we were going to fight him, we, you know, regardless of what Adi says, we were working on a fight for him at the end of the year. And he's